first, let's go to Keynote. Let's add an audio recording to explain our drawing or to give information about our drawing. So I'm going to go to the plus sign and I'm going to tap on record audio. When you are ready to start recording, you just tap this record button down here. And then you just tap on that button again to stop recording. If you want to listen to your recording, you just tap on preview. If you want to edit, that means that you want to fix some parts of it or make it um, shorter or longer, you would just tap edit. Then we'll come up here to insert. Now I'm ready to animate tap on your audio recording and select animate down here we see that it says start audio so tap there and you have two options to start so if you tap on start you can either choose on tap or after transition on tap means that your audio will start playing when you tap the screen or after transition means that it will automatically start playing when you get to that slide. So that's what I want to do. I'm going to choose after your transition. And then I'm going to tap done. So before we animate our drawing, I want to see how long my audio recording is because that will tell me how long I need to animate my drawing. So I'm going to tap on the audio recording again and I'm going to choose edit. And here I just want to see how long it is. So I'm going to come down here and I'm going to drag it until I get to the end of my recording. And I know I'm at the end because if you notice, it gets really flat right here and really thin. So that's how I know I'm at the end. So it's at about a little bit more than 10 seconds. So whenever you're animating, you always want to round up. So I'm going to animate my drawing for 11 seconds. That way I have enough time. So I'm going to go to done. Now let's animate our drawing. And now I'm going to tap on my drawing. And I will select animate. So I'm going to tap right here where it says add build in and I'm going to choose line draw. I'm going to tap away, tap off anywhere else, and you notice that this changed down here. So now I want to tap on line draw, and I need to change the duration of my animation. So this bar right here i'm going to tap on the blue part of it and i'm going to drag it until i see 11.00 and that is because i want it to be 11 seconds okay and now that i have it at 11 and if you're happy with it then you select done now we are going to make them play together we are going to animate it so that our audio and our drawing are happening at the same time. And I'm going to tap on my drawing and I want to choose anime. Tap on line draw at the bottom of the screen. And now I'm going to come here to where it says start. And you have a few options of when it's going to start doing your drawing. You can choose on tap, which means that you have to tap the screen for it to start drawing. You can choose with build one. So this means that it will start drawing once this starts playing, because remember, we also animated this or it will start drawing after build one. So after this plays, I want it to happen while this is playing. So I'm going to choose the middle one with build one and then I'm going to come here and select done. 
and I am ready to see what it looks like all together. Tap on the play button at the top of your screen to see your animations in action. This is James Bowie. He was an important figure in the Texas Revolution. Pretend that I'm saying other really important things that you need to know about James Bowie. So there we go. If you noticed, my audio was playing as it was drawing. So, take this idea and be as creative as you can be. And I hope that you have a lot of fun doing this animated keynote traceover activity.